Hey what's going on guys, it's Carbon here bringing you guys today another brand new video and in today's video I have the most epic domination game that you will probably ever see in Black Ops 3. It is literally one of the best games I've had and it is a game I thought that wouldn't be possible to win. It's one of the best comebacks guys so make sure you watch it till the end of this video and I'm trying to do this commentary until the end of this video we'll see how it goes because I'm not very good at that but anyway I'm gonna talk a bit about this game now in this game, the first half, like, my teammates, first of all, my teammates were absolutely bad, man. Like, these guys were so bad. Just so you know, I had, I dropped 76 kills in this game, and the second best on my team had 18 kills. Just so you know what the, what the, game, what the game is about. So, my team teammates were just absolutely the worst teammates of all time. Um, the whole game, the first half, I was just basically trying to cap the B flag. Like I was, I didn't do any good either, like I dropped a lot of kills compared to my teammates, but my goal was to try and capture B, but it, I couldn't do it because my teammates wouldn't help me. These guys were, I don't know what they were doing, man. Like I was on the B flag so many times by myself trying to capture it, and I ended up dying because obviously my teammates wouldn't help me. And there were so many times that I was so close to my kill streaks and I choked at the end, it was just so frustrating. And, you know, I just wanted to win the game because it's a double cryptic key weekend. So, if you guys didn't know, if you actually win the game, you get more cryptic keys. So, in terms of like, you know, you actually get a lot more if you win the game. So, I wanted to win the game so bad because I've been having really bad lobbies. Today, like, I every 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 uh, lobby I joined literally was just like the worst lobby ever. And I would always join a game that is like halfway done and like absolutely getting destroyed. And there's no way for me to win. So it's been like that the whole day for me. So I really wanted to win this game because I started off pretty good. I got like six kills like really fast too. And but I just ended up choking like my kill streaks um, the first half. Even the second half, like the very first few minutes, we were doing so bad. Um, just so you know, the first half we were like we were at like 53, and th those obviously they got 100. And then the second half, I remember the score was like. 168 to like 90 something one or 170 to like 90 something so we were like basically losing like I, I literally gave up on the game because like there's no way I could win this right because I mean there's no way like my teammates were really bad and they called in like raps the second half of the game the enemy team called in raps and they had like sentry guns going like this was just a game I switched my classes to try and take him out take take out the rap ship but I couldn't find it man the the rap deploy ship was somewhere it was like it was obviously this is redwood right so you there's so many trees around so you couldn't I couldn't find it I couldn't find the damn ship I tried jumping up and down trying to find it but I couldn't find it and um, the second half I was like you know what after like two minutes into the second half I'm like I'm done right I can't do this anymore and these guys were, we were literally stuck at A because these guys were pushing us all the way to A. These guys had us like pinned down at A flag and there's nothing we could do. So I literally gave up and I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to stay here. Don't worry about capping any flags. Just try and get some kills. So I have, you know, just try and earn some kill streaks at least get some kills. So it's, you know, it's good because it's a double cryptic week and at least get some XP, right? So. I was, you know, at the very back of the A spawn, like literally back of the A spawn. I had my scythe, and then I took a few, I got a few kills with it. And at the same time, I'm trying to jump up and down because there's raps going on everywhere. It was just so bad. And then um, I got my first kill streak, which was even not that, I mean, not that great. I had a sentry gun, Cerberus, and the Wraith. So I didn't have like really high kill streaks as well. But I got my um, sentry gun, and then I put it so that it overlooked. Uh, the B flag right now then at the same time I got my uh, Cerberus so I put it down on the B flag as well now that my uh, sentry gun is kind of looking over B so I could capture it so I went on and captured it I think I te my team has helped on that one uh, finally but um, I captured it and I didn't realize you know what why not capture C, C as well right we have A we have B I'm like I'll go for C as well you know why not it's just, just whatever right so I went for a C, I capped it, I got my Wraith, I called in my Wraith, and then the game literally turned to some next level game. Like I literally started, I was like Optic Scumpy for a second. I don't know what happened to me, I just went off, man. I went off. The first half I only had like 29 kills, but I ended up with 76 kills at the end of the game, and I just literally turned into some insane 
like a pro player, <laughs> all right? I started destroying these people. Once I capped C, like we had all three flags and I was literally like going back and forth, going from A to C, A to C, trying to hold down all the flags. And um, I got more servers and I got more sentry guns. I put one overlooking C, so like nobody would capture C. So I was like on A all the time, trying to, try, trying to stop everybody from capping it. It was just insane. And just want to let you know, guys, the Cerberus and the Sentry Gun is probably like those things are probably the most underrated kill streaks of all time. Those things are so good. It started to become one of my favorites, especially the Cerberus. Man, the Cerberus has got me so many kills this past like this weekend. I've been playing and I've been using the Cerberus a lot, and I just let it roam, and it it would just absolutely melt people, man. I think it's almost getting me the same amount of kills as a Wraith. I'm not even lying. Like it was just so good. Um, and uh, literally like I was just going back and forth from A to C trying to hold it down and then it was just we came back so fast because we had them dominated obviously and uh, we won I mean it was like 200 to 199 we were so close and I can't believe I won that game I, I just can't believe it and it was one of the best games I've ever had so I wanted to share with you guys so make sure you watch it till the end because it's epic um, now I just want to give you some tips at the same time if you happen to be in a position where you can't you know if you're the only one who's trying to cap a flag right like you can't do it because obviously your teammates suck but you're trying your ass off trying to capture this thing you know what just stop doing that and just go for your streaks obviously if you have high high kill streaks then it's good but if you don't then it's you know it's kind of sad because then you can't really do much but if you do have high kill streaks just go for your kill streaks just stop worrying about capturing the flag just go for your kill streaks and then once you call them in and then go for capturing the flags because that's the only way you could do it because I was on B flag the half of the time the first half and I couldn't do it myself because it was just I don't know it was just hard and just people were just basically like going around me trying to like they, they all, all they needed was to kill me right because the whole team would come and kill me and then the, nobody would be capping uh, capping the flag so it was just really easy for them but I just absolutely destroyed them the second half. I don't know what happened to me. I literally changed like I literally became a pro player for like two minutes. <laughs> I don't know in my opinion. It was it was just pretty good. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys wanted to watch it a bit fast, you can obviously use the YouTube's a speed uh, boost. Like you can actually uh, make it so that it plays a little bit faster. If you guys wanted to go through it a little bit faster, I try to. I think I'm like only seven minutes at this. It's like a 13 minute video. So hopefully you guys enjoy. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it. If you like to see more videos like this, let me know in the comments. And thank you so much for watching again, guys. And I will see you guys in my next video. Peace out, guys. Let me know, Storm, you love.